and I have been a Pam since three years old. My first uh, professional performance, I was in the very first Mickey Mouse Club. You might wonder at that, but then it was on the radio. And we were broadcasting from uh, the Los Angeles Pantages Theater. And since that time, I've had a lot of time to explore a lot of things, and mostly it's been dancing and acting. But recently, I broke both of my knees and had to start in a new direction. And I started looking into comedy. And this is my very first performance. I'd sure like to have your comment. Thank you.
living for Jesus. But then I looked out the door and there were all these homeless street people. And I said, hey, come on in. There's room for everybody. I think I made a mistake, though, when I invited the street walkers in and asked them to leave. They're, they're, oh, after the police left, my priest said to me, hey, Nani, I'm not really sure you're going to get along in heaven with your unorthodox ways. Well, I said to her, <laughs> When I think of all the people that I know who are absolutely sure they're going to go to heaven, I think I'd rather go to Las Vegas. <laughs> <sighs> tedium, 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 tedium. Um, um, I'm rushing to the emergency room, where they told me my son has just been admitted after his fifth automobile accident. The medic says to me, hey, Nani, why don't you just give up? I said, hell, I can't quit living. I'm having too much fun. <laughs> I've even tried living through somebody else. My little granddaughter came to me and she said, Nani, I think it'd be fun to take ballet lessons. And so I rushed right down to Dolly Dinky's dancing school and I enrolled her in tap and ballet and jazz and modern. She's even taking elocution and voice. One day my little sweetheart's going to be a moon. So I took her down to this audition for a soap opera. And they cast me as a topless, aging tap dancer <laughs> in one life to live. This ingenue came up to me and she said, Nani, what makes you think that anybody's going to want to look at your 55-year-old boobs? Well, I said right to her, honey, that motion is still up for grabs. <laughs>